how we're going to PC dense videos. Today we're going to be talking about how to measure the quantity of fluids you should be drinking during your workout. So what I've just done is I'm going to weigh myself on the scale before and after my workout. You should weigh exactly the same. If you haven't, for example, if you weigh after your workout and you're half a kilo lighter, that means you've lost half a litre of fluids and you haven't drunk enough water. Just keep in mind that water weighs exactly one kilo a litre. So if you're half a kilo lighter, you've lost 500 ml of fluid and that's how you calculate. So what you should be doing is, you should weigh exactly the same before and after your workout. So let's have a look what happens to me today during my workout. Okay, so I'm in the car heading home. Um, as you guys just saw, just weighed myself again, and I happen to weigh exactly the same, uh, 97.4 kilo, if not 0.1 of a kilo off. Now, I actually was hoping that I wouldn't be the same, so I can give you some sort of idea of how to make your adjustments, uh, but I weighed exactly the same. Now, technically, what happened was, I actually lost 0.6 of a kilo uh, in that workout, and I know that because in the workout, I actually drunk 600 ml of water so the water that i drank in the workout replaced the water lost and therefore ended up weighing the same <laughs> 